Hello, welcome back once again, lovely people. <laughs> we are now beginning episode three of Batman the Telltale series. Previously on Batman the Telltale series. <laughs> Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents look that the They're waiting for you in hell! So the real question is, then who's just behind all this? Life. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt, no consequence. Penguin isn't the only child of Arkham. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? I think we basically fried our relationship with Harvey at this point. <laughs> Just so we're clear, you and me, we're on shaky ground. Jim, listen. No, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. So sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. Moderator, you there? Yes. You. Oh, yes. Thank you for volunteering. My downtrodden brothers and sisters of Gotham, you have nothing yes, to fear. Are we are the children of Arkham. General Hospital. Mayor Dent. You know, I always assumed Harvey would win, but not like this. Won by default. He's probably pissed he didn't get his landslide fair and square. Hey, Harvey's going to be okay. You don't know that. I just, I keep wondering. Why did you do it? Harvey needed you. Why save me? Harvey's your best friend. I'm nothing to you. I just don't get it. I need you as an ally. So it all boils down to strategy then. Mm. I don't think I can do this. What are you talking about? I don't want to see what... I just can't, okay? I have to go. I'm sorry. Harvey needs you right now. Do it for him. I'm sorry, Bruce. I wish I could, but... You can. It's my fault he's in there. I don't have anything to say to him that would make this better. Please, Bruce. Don't tell him I was here. I don't think he'd understand. No, no he would not. <laughs> Gotham is still reeling after last week's mayoral debate. With the drugging and subsequent murder of Mayor Hamilton Hill, Harvey Dent was left running unopposed. After a rather lackluster election, Mayor Dent was sworn in from his hospital bed. 
Word is he's still recovering from major hey, injuries Bruce. sustained at the event. Harvey, I am so sorry this happened. Hey, come on. It's not your fault. Yeah, well, I'm sorry anyway. I haven't actually seen it yet. You've had me wrapped up this whole time. <laughs> Numbed beyond belief. Maybe it's not that bad. I mean, my family, we heal quick. Could be fine. It's... It's what's on the inside that counts, right? You'll always be beautiful to me, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Come on, that's what they tell the girl who doesn't get asked to prom. That, easy, I appreciate the effort, though. Oh, what have you got there? I, uh... <laughs> I brought you some flowers, though I see I'm not the first. Yeah, well, my mother and my secretary, uh, every sick boy's dream. One woman <laughs> I thought would visit, or at least call, hasn't. Selena's been a no-show. I thought she'd at least come by to congratulate me, if nothing else. Guess we were as close as I thought. Guess I can't blame her, the way I look now. Yeah, she's probably just busy, hasn't had a chance to come by yet. You'll hear from her. <laughs> Easy for you to be optimistic about women. Be sure no one ever loses Bruce Wayne's number. <laughs> I am glad you're here, though. God, it's been infuriating. Just sitting here and having nothing but time to think about what happened. I wish I could make myself turn it off completely. Watching footage of the debate over and over. Look at me. Preaching it. What a great guy you are while I go and get my face bashed in. It's easy. Every news station is showing it. Regurgitating the same old sound bites. Don't do this to yourself. There's nothing you can do to change what happened. Replaying that moment will only drive you crazy. Yeah, I know that. But here I am. Trust me. <laughs> I'm you crazy. Stop. I was hopeless, Bruce. Helpless. Couldn't do anything. Penguin would have just beaten me to death right there in front of everyone. He wanted to. Yeah, I can... I can still hear him laughing. What they did to Hill, to the moderator. I have to live with that. But you heard them up there. But Penguin and that maniac on screen. Oh, this isn't over. I need to stay ahead nope, of them. This is just They're started. trying to cause discord. That stunt at the debate was just the first step. Batman stopped them from killing you the other night, but they will try again. I won't hide from them, Bruce. But tonight's speech, they'll know where I stand. Wait, wait, wait tonight? I, I thought you were supposed to be recovering. My assistant is on her way to pick me up. At the election, I was able to talk the hospital into releasing me early. <sighs> Not that they're too happy about it. All the doctors keep telling me to take it easy. But how can I? Well, stay in the chair, Mr. Dent. Oh, don't overexert yourself, Mr. Dent. Do what you need to do. I know how important this election is to you. Thanks. I'm glad none of someone around here understands that. Come on, you do the same in my position. Which is why I won't even try to tell you to not look into those tapes. I know how much you loved your father, Bruce. You know, that debate was hard on you, too. Finding out your dad drugged Esther Cobblepot. Hill admitting to having both of them killed. A lot to process. I'm sorry. Just because I keep reliving it doesn't mean you want to. This just proves that I never really knew it. I was just hiding who he really was. I'm sorry. I know you'll pull through this. Look, I, uh... I realize what a terrible friend I've been to you. I was so focused on the campaign. I, I thought distancing myself from you was the only option. I'm sorry. I understand. I don't like it, but you I understand. Don't have to explain yourself to me, Harvey. It was the right call for the campaign. I get that. Still, I abandoned you when you needed me. That's not the kind of friend I want to be. What is that? Batman symbol. Coming from near the GCPD? <laughs> That's one way to get the guy's attention. <laughs> oh, I saw it. <laughs> and look, I, I should get going, Hart. What? Already? 
What else do you have to do? My sister won't be here for another hour. It's, uh, it's Alfred. Is he okay? Yeah, 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 he just needs to talk to me. Yeah, of course, go ahead. Uh, tell the old man I said hi. Mm. It's very honest, not, you, uh, um, you rest up, up front, but Thanks, honest. <laughs> Gonna be interesting. <laughs> Unit six in pursuit of suspects westbound on 15th Street. Is it the children of Arkham? Can you confirm? Negative. They're taking shots at us whenever we get close. Understood. Stay on them. We'll think of something. A little help would be nice. Hang in there, all right? Oh, they knew we'd be there. We don't have enough officers to deal with this. Everyone stretched thin. I'm doing what I can. I have to go. That light has a bad on it, Jim. <laughs> you give me a number, though, I'll rethink my methods. <laughs> I'm just glad it got your attention. I didn't have a lot of options. So. Here we are. Not a bad idea. I'm impressed. I have good ones every now and then. I'd rather have you arrested than come to you for help. But the truth is, we're desperate. I'm calling a truce. Just for tonight. Bring you up to speed. Right. Rene Montoya, one of my officers. The one who tried to shoot me. I know, but hear me out. <laughs> she tried yes. to clear her name after those animals manipulated her into killing Falcone. She's supposed to be on leave. But she got a tip on the children of Arkham's chemical stash, went rogue. She's out there alone, and I can't spare anyone to back her up. I told her to wait, but this is personal. The children of Arkham pumped her full of that junk. She's a good cop. She's a good cop. I'm, I'm going to go help her. I'll find her. <laughs> we'll take down the children of Arkham together. That's what I like to hear. She's the just children doing her job. <laughs> all of a sudden. Where the hell they all come from? I never heard of them before. And that debate. Oh, they're tearing up the entire city. You saw the video from Arkham Asylum. The whole city did. That all happened a long time ago. It got dug up. And so did all the other. Gordon, this is Schultz. Yep. Over. Gordon here. We've got a problem with the mayor, sir. What happened? Is he okay? I don't know. We lost him. He took off and left us behind. Christ, one what? crisis. I can't do it. Oh, drink. goodness. <laughs> We gotta keep both Montoya and Dent safe. Doing Dent? Somehow. I'm on it. Oh, I better not have to make a decision again. That always. Launch the drones. I need eyes. Oh, Mont. Lucius has made some upgrades. I'll let him explain. Who are you talking to? You got a whole team or something? Mike Butler. <laughs> yeah, hilarious. <laughs> All right, patching you through to R&D and Wayne uh, Enterprises. Yes. Batman, so listen. The first model was only equipped for visual surveillance. But seeing how you use them at the skyline, I thought you'd need an audio feed as well. The microphones are incredibly sensitive. They can pick up sounds from up to 500 yards. In some cases, you'll even be able to hear through walls. Like X-ray hearing. Nice, nice work. Thanks. I'll talk to you soon. Any idea where they might be? Montoya's car was spotted crossing the bridge to Arkham Island. Could be where the handoff is happening. What about Dent? We're probably headed to his acceptance speech. We just left the hospital and we lost sight of him. Barrels of this stuff to transfer. Not a big window to unload all of that. They said they wanted it done tonight, so it's got to be done. You want to argue with them? Be my guest. You just keep an eye out for that cop. Nobody move. This is the police. Get her. No, 
Please, just leave it. It's not gonna get any better. But, but you're bleeding. Then let Gotham see it. Is that? No, I told you it's fine. That car's been behind us since the hospital. Oh, God, man. Is this guy trying to drive us off the oh, road? Oh, man. What the? Oh, damn it! Montoya's in real danger, but so is Harvey. Oh, goodness. Sorry, Harv. Gonna send whatever men you can spare after debt. I'll round up what officers I can. Gonna have to head out there myself too. I know this is risky, Batman. Just be careful. <laughs> Already gone. <laughs> Episode three. New world order. Major disturbance here. Several armed suspects on the loose. Toy, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Gonna smack you upside the head when we're done with this. It's over. Drop the gun. Look, I promise I'm not gonna shoot you, okay? I used to think you were a threat, but I was wrong. We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? Those guys had me pinned down. If you hadn't shown up when you did... I... Yeah, you're just doing it's your job. It's okay. It's in the past. I forgive you. Thank you. It means a lot coming from you. I don't know what I was thinking coming out here again. <laughs> I don't know what you were thinking either. I, <laughs> I could be dead. Or you could be dead. And it'd be on me. Don't beat yourself up. You did a lot of good here today. Sometimes the risk is worth it. I'll keep that in mind. I still don't understand how they knew I was coming. Heads up. The cops just sent three black and whites to stop our guys going after Dent. No chatter. Sounds like Gordon's with them. Someone's gotta help Gordon. They know he's coming. Go. I'll see what I can find here. I'm not giving up on this. Hopefully we can still do something about Dent. Yeah, but they knew I was coming. They seem to be getting info on the GCPD's whereabouts. Not sure how. I need an update on Harvey. Bringing it up now. Deborah, get down! <gasps> Mr. Dent, what did you do to him? I said get back in the car! There's more of them coming! Put down your weapon! You killed any of them! Everybody take cover! You'd better get down there. On my way. Self-defense, he says. New mayor's pretty tough, turns out. Killed one of those guys attacking him with his bare hands. Dent did that? Guess the fellow's lucky Dent got to him before you did, huh? He 
you have something to say, then say it. We all know how you operate. You like to see them hurt, don't you? They're not dead, but they wish they were. At least this one died quick. We got our asses <laughs> handed to wrong. us. They knew you were coming. How? We've been using a secure channel. You saying we got a leak? Yep. Gordon to command. Anyone, Anyone there? there? Command, command here. here. What is it, Gordon? Turn that off. What? It's been compromised. The children of Arkham are listening in on the GCPD's communications. I'm gonna look into this. I'll let you know what I find. Bruce? The GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate... Panic. <laughs> It'll cause a panic. Just what the children of Arkham want. Mass chaos. That seems to be how the Penguin does business. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? That's a tough one. But I should have it cracked soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. Already on my way. <laughs> is no longer popular with anyone there, at all. I'll meet you down in the lab. Some aspects of the children of Arkham surveillance are worrying. Great. Bruce. Chairwoman. I didn't think you'd be here. I was, uh... I used to look to Thomas for guidance in hard times. Must seem silly. After everything that's happened. You know what they say about old habits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I miss them, too. Both of them. I know. Every day, I wish a father was still with us. He was wise beyond his years. And Martha. She was such a delight to have around. I've been called in for an emergency board meeting. I wasn't told about it. You weren't invited, Bruce. You are the topic of discussion for the board. They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Whether to dismiss you or not. You have to understand, Bruce. This company is bigger than any one individual. We have to keep face. And after no, this I didn't scandal, do anything. You get, my father, you're all garbage. I'm not him, Regina. I would never compromise the lives of innocents for my own benefit. I know that, Bruce. But you have to understand that what the public wants to hear isn't always what we want to hear. The whole city is watching to see what our next move is going to be. Bruce, I've got something. You need to get down here. Now. I worked with your parents for years, and neither of them gave any indication of foul play. How could you have ever known? Bruce. You're nothing like him, Bruce. We always build up the people closest to us. When they fall, it's a terrible blow to and everyone around do them. something. Then go tell that to the board. What do you think I'm trying to do, Bruce? I'm not your enemy. You should remember that. Don't forget who your allies are, Mr. Wayne. I'll come find you after. I'll be right down, Lucius.
It's good to hear she's still in your corner. <laughs> Spying on my conversations again? Hey, I'm looking out for you. There have been whispers that the board was going to take action against you. If you lose the company, that man will take a massive hit too. Mm -hmm. I know the cave is well equipped, but all of this is owned and paid for by the company. You can't afford to lose their resources. I don't need to worry about the board. I've got plenty of money. We'll make do. Yeah, plenty now, but still not enough for all of this. Right now, finding out how the children of Arkham are spying on the police is more important. What have you got? It's Wayne Tech, Bruce. As you know, Wayne Enterprises is a telecommunications giant. Uh-oh. <laughs> if someone were to, say, uh, build a back door into that tech... You're telling me the children of Arkham hacked into this system? So that's the thing. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, you're not gonna like it. No <laughs> shortage of bad news lately. Might as well just pile more on. Well, you see this back door they're using. I built it. You? What are you talking about? When your mission as Batman started, you needed a way to monitor the city. Well, this is how. I piggyback Batman's surveillance onto Wayne Enterprise's signal. If the children of Arkham have access to the same system, does that mean they know my identity? It looks like they've only accessed the GCPD so far. Not a lot of activity otherwise. I'll have Alfred warn Gordon. The GCPD needs to get rid of their Wayne Tech devices. Smart move. I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's going to take longer to force them out of the system. The question remains, how did the children of Arkham find out about the back door in the first place? They shouldn't have been able to find it, not unless they knew what they were looking for. Whoever broke in certainly knew how to cover their tracks. We have a mole. There's no way they could have gained access without someone on the inside. Only a handful of people at the highest level could possibly find out about the back door. I'm gonna keep working on this Children of Arkham business. See if there's a way to shut down their access entirely. We better lock mm -hmm. this stuff down, just in case. <laughs> 